Welcome back to Beyond Two Souls. Let's do a quick night session before we get into the nitty gritty of what uh, the next couple episodes are going to be about. I'm so glad Yay, we're I'm finally so doing finally doing a night session. That way, I don't have to fall asleep here in the morning. <laughs> I always think the longer the loading uh, loading screen, the more there is. So that was about medium size. There might be some stuff here. Hmm. Is there a version of the game where it's in order? Yeah, there is. Oh my god, why didn't we just play that one? Because we couldn't this... record PS4. <laughs> oh! And, and, and also because this is the PS3 version. This is the version that came out first. This is David Cage's vision. This is his initial vision, what he really wanted Beyond Two Souls to be. You know, oh the god, more you this... say that, the more impact it loses. <laughs> is this Dadfo? Yeah, this is Willem Dadfo over there. Not going in there. It's too scary. It's dark. Dad foe, I'm tired. I don't want to watch any more walk <laughs> Oh, jeez. Is that what time it is? It's 5 a.m. I'm sorry. What? I was concentrating on my work. No, uh, I, I feel you, Dad foe. Hey, this morning I bought your book. What do you say we get you tucked in and I read to you? Yes, please. <laughs> Oh, Aww. I, must I love it. The, other room. the big plot Why twist is that book he bought her was the same cookbook we saw in the last <laughs> flashback. Oh, shit. It's a Necronomicon. Sure, <laughs> I wish. <laughs> she just loves that there devil. Okay, into the pitch black room without a door. Uh, Dang. You, you have Aiden, you'll be fine. <laughs> Turn the oh. lights on. So. Oh, there we go. Oh shit! What? What? You can see the camera jerking a little bit. That's me trying to hit the the stick so I can grab onto anything. Is there anything over there? Nope. Anything over here? Nope. Nothing there. Oh, there it is. Hang on. There it is. And this is the part in the movie theater where you hear that one lady in the background go, "Oh shit!" I didn't. Do you want to read fairy tales? No, I want to read Game of Thrones. When it That's opened a fairy up, tale. I really did think, or I really did thought it was that. Cookbook, Actually, but should, uh, my mistake. What the it, fuck? It, it should be a Song of Ice and Fire. Oh, by the way, I guess there's she's seeing scepter, uh, specters, but that's nothing new, is it? We've known uh, this for a while does now. Does she still do that? Like, why? Yeah, can we continue with this cool shit, please? Are you ready for some uh, David Cage tone deaf bullshit? Yeah, it's like when she grew up, she got boring. Now we can get down to the serious business of bedtime stories. With Adam Sandler. <sighs> what the fuck? Jody, you okay? <laughs> this is actually cool. I love pain. It would be, but. <laughs> <didn't know she's laughs> no, it's really? okay. I just saw ghosts of your dead wife and daughter. I love that guy because he's like the only one who's a real <gasps> dad to Jody. Oh my yes, god, is that who that is? Oh, that was just a guess. Oh god, oh my god. Nathan Dawkins. Seven days, doctor. <laughs> Why, yes, I would love a vacation suite. Uh. Oh wait, I might have called it. Nathan, what's up? Netflix wants me to do Death Note. I have no idea what anime is. My wife. Ha! Called it! Thought that they were coming back from my mother's. Truck. Drunk driver. Wrong side of the road. He's taking it very well. That goddamn Spider Man! I can really feel his Willem de Woe. They're dead. Oh! Um, oh, that just happened now! Okay, uh huh! Ah, oh, fuck! Right yep! I'll be right back. Come on, Joe. Oh, but, but what about my bedtime story? Ah, oh, shit! Hey, hey! Don't, don't break your promise, old man! I want my fucking bedtime story!
Well, okay. There's the pizza box from the last episode. Oh, that was like low time awesome. Damn it, now All I right. have to pay attention. And we're heading back to the mission suite. All right, so this is the mission. Which mission? The mission. This, t there is no space to fit anymore. more spaces between uh, this and Hunted, which means that after this, we're going to find the reason as to why Jody is on the run. Cool. Oh, it has to be that guy. He commands a heavily armed militia, using it to control several important districts in the city, which means none of our humanitarian aid is getting through. You have to find Jamal and eliminate him. I, I know my mission is to eliminate him, but can I fault in him for his stats? How would you still be able to work with him after that horrible date? <laughs> the game keeps trying to push us together, and I... Ugh. I know, it's horrid. So, uh, remember when I phased two plates together? <laughs> Yep. The last American soldier that was captured here was pulled through the city behind a jeep. They found his head, one of his legs in a fishing boat. Oh, great. Whoa. All right, so I'm not crazy. I saw that too. Yeah. <laughs> Watch yourself out there, Jody. So, uh... Basically, Whatever. yep, move away. Seriously, there was an Get option away. to kiss him during Get a goddamn away. mission. It's a briefing session. Oh, you are on the job, bitch. <sighs> <laughs> you know, I never expected adult Jody to be horny on Maine. <sighs> just, just I roll my eyes at this just romanticization of yeah, the military. Really. You know, it's, it's just good luck, Jody. I mean, there's romanticism in warfare, and then there's just, you know, glorifying the military lifestyle. It's just, oh. you Okay, know, wait, 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 wait. So, let me get this. They put paint all over her for camouflage, but they're going to make her jump in the fucking water? And it's all washed off. Gotcha. Remember! You need to be as quiet as possible! <laughs> that waterproof shit, I guess. It kind of looks like it's jungle camo, too, for a desert setting. Doesn't make swear, sense. Swear to God, if she comes up from the shore and asks what a hind D is doing here. <laughs> oh, storming Normandy 50 years later. That's the guy waiting for David Cage to make a good game. What year is this? Check the uh, soldiers what year did the game come out? No, what year is this supposed to be? Uh, Just like where she is. The, the, it's not specified. So I like to think for most of David Cage's games, it's in the not too distant future. <laughs> okay. All right. So go on, give us a number. Dudes over there, but it looks like the game's not going to be linear. It looks like we really have to do things a bit organically. So at least. We are getting to some actual, honest to God, gameplay! Wait, About do we have to take out those guys, in. or...? Yeah, we're on the mission! We are Metal Gear Soliding this right now! We've been dumped in here like Metal, Gear, like Metal Gear Solid 3. We're in the opening of Metal Gear Solid 4, pretty much, and it's basically the same gameplay as Metal Gear Solid 5, maybe? There's a takedown animation that's way too dark to see, but I guess he caught me somehow. Um, ow. Luckily, if you get caught, it's not the end of the world. Maybe a few game over sequences, but at least we got that guy. We could take his gun, but I guess that's not our style. Uh, eh. sure. So where to next? Those is my guns question. suck anyway. Let's try over here. Up. Well, let's take me back to the beach. Let's head this way then. Stairs. Oh man, it, man, it is dark. <laughs> I was just about to say that. What the hell, really? Here we go. All right, Aiden. I can get this guy. Oh, sweet. Eh, eh, Choke. Eh, 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 eh. Hang on. That's over. Almost over. There you go. 
Hey. Excuse me, sir. We hear there's a special agent on the island. We'll take her out. She seems to have the force on her side. <laughs> We'll take her out! Well, do, I don't want to go too fancy. Uh, maybe like oh Olive Garden God. or something? Why is it so dark? How did you even see that? So I'm using a new capture uh, software. I think the capture <laughs> might be a little bit dark on this. No, and, that's uh, normal. So... Are you sure? It's actually showing the proper colors. It's showing pure black. That's what it should be showing. It is that dark. Well... Is it that dark when you're playing it? No, it, it isn't. I think it's because I have the brightness settings up so I can see everything. Yeah, so if <laughs> To you avoid were... situations like this? Oh my god, if you're... <laughs> so if you were just playing so this on, on the TV you just got, which may have been the situation, this is black as fuck. Yeah, it is. But now we're back. We're good. He's gotta stay in the brightly lit areas, and maybe I'll up the brightness uh, next uh, on the next go-around. It's like when you first play Oblivion, you have to, like, <laughs> up the dark. Because it's so fucking dark, you have to up the brightness. It's like, but, I, but you have to use a oh torch. It's like, God. uh, yeah, I've got a torch of modern technology. Yeah, really. Well, where do they want me to go? It's, it's not, not entirely clear right now. Further. Oh, did they, okay. Do they just have random street Ow. lights? I think so. I don't, know where to, I don't know where the game wants me to go. Ah! Item, please. I need your help now. What do you want from me? Oh, look, there's dudes over there. Oh, great. Go that Let's way. Go. Okay. What the heck? Do you want me to go? The ah! Fine. Let's go further then. <gasps> oh, jeez. No. Oh, ah, no, nothing. Nothing. Uh. <clears throat> yeah. Okay. Remember your training. Basically, it's the same as your training. Honestly, I never thought this game would get to this point. But then again, I didn't know what I expected from uh! Beyond Two Souls. Yeah, I didn't either. Beyond two genres of gameplay. I wasn't expecting like CIA or sand monsters or anything or like that. Actual gameplay. Play. Yeah. It always surprises you that Mr. Wait, Cage that So what's blue mean what's blue again? Blue means you can't interact with them but they're like there. It's kind of like okay. detect uh, de de uh, detecting life. And red you can kill. Red you can kill, yellow you can take control of. Oh okay, right. So I guess for now we'll just uh combat very, crawl. Very subtle, you know. There we go. <laughs> oh, sorry. I didn't cover that up. <laughs> 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 Ah, got sand in my eye. Oh. Oh shit. And caught. I can see your head like right gotcha. there. Gotcha. <laughs> You're it. Whoa. I could not see. It was too dark. <laughs> it is super dark in some places. Jeez. No wonder I'm gonna she's blend in like it. Batman. Ellen Page. I wonder if she pulls a a cronk from Emperor's New Groove, has her own battle music that she sings. Oh my God, yes. Yeah, very silently. She's just like. Possession. Ah. Bang. Bang! Ah! Oh! I feel like I could have taken out more with him. Yeah, well... I think it's only in the vicinity. Eh, yeah, no, whatever. Alright, looks like, uh, coast is clear. If there were any other guys, they must have scattered. So, into the ruined hotel. Where did the hotel. guy that you saved go? Uh, I think he took off. He's like a metal slug, uh, civilian. You save them, they just go, Thank you! And disappear. Thank you. <laughs> Beetle the war hero. <laughs> this Bye. is why he. Only, this is why he sells wares now. <laughs> Bye. Yeah, it's hard to get work after the war, you know. <laughs> he became a war profiteer. It's like all so, these weapons. Thank you. That's why he's so sad in Wind Waker because he's remembering everything. <laughs> what are you buying? Zanaki Hotel. 
I need my antidepressants this month. <laughs> Drinks liquid courage. Thank you. <laughs> God, it's so dark. I hate it. I can barely see Don't leave it. me alone with the ghosts of my past. <laughs> Beetle, it's okay. Just please sell me a horse. Bloodied shirt. You know, I, I'm hmm. thinking it's canon that uh, Ryan taught her to keep her head as far away from the thing as God, possible. Really? What the fuck? He's, like I just even say, no, nah, yeah, Aiden's a supernatural being from beyond. He can do whatever you want. You, you can hold, you can hold it like as far away as you can, as long as you're touching it. If you're touching it, he can do it. And I just want to tell him, no, it's not the hand, it's the head, you idiot. But that's beside the point. He's over at the he's over at the, at the cathedral now. So now they really are gonna make me just string me along. God. Fucking, oh, I'm wanting to think if this has a sudden crossover with Ouroboros and Kijuju. Yes, I will take a Resident Evil Five for five hundred. Thank you. Do you really think David Cage will really infect the world with global saturation of emotion? Yes. Seven minutes is all he has to spare for actual gameplay, and then it goes back to. <laughs> Just uh, the regular stuff. What the hell did she do to knock him out? Nothing. I mean, have you ever been hit in the back of the knee? Yes. It's enough to knock me out. She hit him with America! <laughs> <laughs> and it instantly made his bones vaporize into dust. Jeez. So, uh, I guess I'll just climb this ladder if you guys aren't using it. <laughs> Don't mind me. Just getting on this noisy metal roof. Clang, 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 clang. Really? There was no noise from that? I don't believe it. Oh, hi there. How are you? <laughs> Would you like to see our president? He is busy today, but maybe you could see him in the morning. <laughs> Wakanda forever! God. <laughs> it's just like, shh. Sleep. Sleep. Jamil? Jamil, are you okay up there? Hey, what happened? Oh god! Oh, oh they're no. shooting at you! <laughs> <laughs> Don't! Um, oh god, uh, knees, pitch black! Knees, ugh. Uh, oh, can't go that I can't way. even oh. tell what she's doing. <laughs> so there's a bunch of dudes over there. We're gonna go this way. Because I guess the cathedral's over there. The game's kind of pointing us this way. Hey, buddy! Are you innocent? Who cares? <laughs> So this is when Beyond Two Souls turns into an artsy game, and you play as a silhouette. Oh my god. Yeah, artsy. Again, I think it might be my capture. She is just like a shadow in the shadows. I mean, it's, <laughs> it's like true HDR, maybe. I don't know. Fucking. Trust me, your capture's fine. Is that what we get from going from a 720 signal to an 8, 1080p signal? <laughs> Oh god. That really reminds me of, like, Horizon. When you slid like that. <laughs> huh? What the hell was that? What is that? Somebody set off the canister! Is it an imperialist here to- ah, ah, ah! I swear there was a guy over there, but okay. What did she do? Nothing. She just covered his mouth and was like, shh. Don't talk. Ellen Page can Lay secrete there. a special uh, 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 secretion that is poisonous to the touch, and it kills him instantly. Okay. <laughs> and ironically, it can double as a smelling salt. It's like in the palm. There's a little hole that comes out of her palm. Left hand is sleep, right hand is wake up! <laughs> yeah, it's like, uh, uh, wake up, grab a brush, and, and, you know, uh, put on... Put on a little makeup. Uh, um, Some makeup, yeah. Uh, uh, why do you uh, leave the you, keys upon the table? Do you leave uh, leave the keys upon the table. Uh, it's you're missing it about was... like twelve ellipses, right? <laughs> I'm just paraphrasing, you know, just kind of doing a, a quick run through of what an Ellen Page performance is like. Sound like if Jeff Goldblum sang that song. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh God! Uh, wake up! Can you imagine the two of them in a seat together? <laughs> <laughs> Willem Dafoe and Jeff Goldblum. No, no, uh, Jeff Goldblum and Ellen Page. Oh. <laughs> well, the amount of ellipses, there's not enough dots. It's like, would you, uh, uh, like to, uh, 
go out and get uh, uh, some uh, burgers uh, with me, uh, Ellen. <laughs> and she's like, uh, sure. Yeah. Sure. Uh, sure. Uh, I guess you know we could we could maybe go out for you know. I guess some some sort of you know you know burgers. You know I mean I'm 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 I'm, I'm good with burgers if you if, if, if you want. <laughs> Shatner comes in and goes. Ah oh, yes, I would like for us to have some pizza as well. Oh my God! Are you all right? What's wrong with you? Guy. Why are you choking suddenly? Are you okay, oh, no. Mr. Captor? Kita of the Death Note strikes again! Tell me your name. Oh my god, how do you see anything? I know you could see playing, but... Yeah, on, on my screen it's fine, but man is it dark. Is there like a night vision option I'm missing? <laughs> <laughs> oh, please figure that out. Three minutes left in the video. Honestly, ah! I think Iden vision is your X-ray vision. I guess so. No, it's still dark it's with him though. Still pretty black though. No, uh, wait, not close no, enough. Wait, come here, come here. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. Oh. You bastard! We'll get you. Right behind that wall. Too bad about that guy though. Oh well. I'm not here to save everybody. I'm here to kill one guy. And here is the cathedral where to he is at. Stop him from killing the rest of them. The cathedral. From where did I see it in my vision? Probably in there. They came here. They came from here. Yeah, everywhere. Yeah. Uh, the floor is all sticky. Ugh. All right. Really? I don't even want to know what they do in there. Oh. Again, it's not the hand. Who taught you it was the hand? Ah, uh, get it up there. I just, I just imagine that Ryan guy is like, oh yeah, yeah, he just touched it. I, I, there it is. It's like no. I mean, if he wanted to actually make her look a fool, he'd say, oh yeah, just put your face to the floor. <laughs> <laughs> It'd probably be easier. I would you tell me this? <laughs> That's a little better. See, look how easy that was. Oh my god, I can barely see what's going on. Uh, I, I think it's something to do with butta butta butta, rat ta tat ta tat ta tat, and oh, I've been shot. Bang, 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 bullet, bullet gun. Yeah, yeah, that, that too. Well, wherever our next, uh, place to be is, it's not in here. I guess another thing that, uh, Jerry can do is... <laughs> oh my god! Tell me your secrets, pamphlet! How do I save money? If you need a structured sentiment and need cash now, call JG Wentworth! 877! Cash no! <laughs> oh, I can save cash now. Imagine the savings. By the way, if I offend anybody with my African voice, I don't mean to. Oh. Yeah, that's <sighs> not what we're going for. All right, we found the Temple of Time. When do I get my hang glider? Wait, is there a Korok seed oh over there? Oh god, it does look like that. Yeah, ha, ha. Bang, 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 Don't bang, bang. shit! <gasps> Shh. Yeah, you kidding? She'll use Aiden to find all of them. <laughs> Aiden, I need you! I need, Aiden, I need you, Aiden, I need you. Cheater, <laughs> really. Come on, can't you find your own collectibles? God. Great! 
A child soldier. I, I, I just want to help you. Aiden, translate. I want to come towards you. I don't, doesn't work don't, that way. Don't shoot I, me. I can okay? translate, but I can't trans. I can't communicate with you that way. And leave him to die. Kid needs help. No, really. Do something. Oh, fine. Help him. Heal All right. Him. Heal we, him. We, we, we will help the poor boy. Let's see. Uh, he hurt his leg. I forgot to do this. Okay. I gotta go over to Jody him. and interact with him. He's gonna die if I don't help him. And now. There we, we go. Again. It's not the hands. I do that. You don't need to do that. God, yes, heal him. And got him. <laughs> oh, 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 my head. Oh, oh. I wish there was some translation. That would have been nice. I would have liked that too. Or are we... I don't understand a word you're but saying. But I guess it's supposed to be because we don't understand. So she's in the CIA, right? The Central What Agency? The I stands for what? Intelligence. Intelligence! You're telling me that they were training her all this time for this one mission and they didn't teach her a lick of Arabic? Really? Jody. Or any kind of African dialect? Oh shit. So, uh, that is Salim. Salim is our, uh, child soldier, uh, friend. What's his name? Salim. Salim? Salim. I like it. And uh, things are a little bit heavy now because I think they've been getting wind about what we've been doing here. So, oh, gun combat! Oh, they definitely finally. know we're here now. I need you now. So Salim's gonna help us uh, get through uh, the thick of things here, and Aiden's gonna help us even further. <laughs> so he's gonna be a traitor? I guess I don't really believe that, but yeah, I don't. You know, I don't think it works that way. I mean, just to bring up a parallel would, she for would a game, really that. have to like do something for this child soldier. Right, I mean, get to go against his country. Metal Gear Solid Five dealt with uh, child soldiers, and I know that game came out like two years later, but it handled them a lot better because. You know, the first time you see them, Miller goes, Oh, jeez, child soldiers, oh my god. You know, it's like, it's repulsive to see them. And yeah. you ki and you kill one, you're, like, game's over. You're not supposed to kill children. That's that's, that's a bad no-no. You don't kill children, otherwise you, you lose. Exactly. And uh, even when you do rescue the, chi the child children soldiers, you still gotta, like, re-educate them and put them in a different leg of mother base before you can actually bring them into general population. But here it's just, ah, you healed me! I am okay now and I will be on your side! Yeah. Forgetting about the loyalties of who I'm- exactly. who, who I've sworn to, even though they've beaten nine. that into me and my ch and my friends for years exactly. ever since I've been they alive. Would not just well, go against... Wouldn't you be grateful to somebody who helped you out? In their case... No, because or what I, she's American. Or That's what I've not shot how the, it works. Yeah, I would have shot the American whore on sight. Yeah, as soon as she came around the corner, she would have been shot. That's how instilled, ingrained those child soldiers are. Or maybe he's a, a stupid child soldier. He doesn't yeah, know I the guess. meaning of loyalty. You'd have he to, didn't. I suppose. Well, Jody never learned about ambushes. But then again, ambushes are there for a reason. So, the problem with uh, this kind of stuff is that, you know, I just want to kill this guy, but it's it's really stressful just to take just take him out! Just take he took, him out! He just, took a cinder block to the face! Yeah, really, that's... Oh, he's got Tevlar underneath that mask! No, I always hated these kind of Magini. I always have so much health, hard to take him down. Oh! <laughs> I would say that better have killed him. Remember that one scene in Indiana Jones? <laughs> yep, just fed up with it. Fire. Oh, the sun's coming up, could you tell? Can we see around corners now? I'm alright. I'm making 
Well, uh, on the plus side, we can see better, but now they can see better now, too. That's and true. sniper shot. Oh, it's gonna make it tough to not be seen now. The tower. But, so that's where he is now, I guess. The tower's over there. That's where I need to go. Please tell me he can understand English, but... I to lose. Yeah, I, I hope that's the case. So, uh... Well, in that case, he's smarter than she is. So, uh... I think here's a good place to, uh... Yeah, I just saw a tank. I, I think we're gonna take a second here and just, uh... Kind of relax and twist the arm a little bit. Shut up, Salim! There's a uh, fucking tank. Great. So next time on Beyond Two Souls, we'll be finishing this uh, mission, and uh, we'll be finding out the exact reason as to why we are now hunted.